Well, it's 24th of um, May 2015 and it's about half past eight in the morning. So we've got the nice subtle sun um, bringing all the colours out of things. And uh, this is Helen's iris bed. We've got a friend who gives Helen irises with the idea of um, painting them. And they're really out in flower just at the moment. So uh, we're not going to find all the technical names, but there's a brown one. <laughs> it's not just brown though, is it? Brown, yellow and orange. It's a real mix. Yes. 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 And it's that furry bit in there that you like particularly, isn't it? Oh yes. <laughs> yeah, these are bearded, proper bearded iris. They've oh, got oh, the... oh, is that the beard? I suppose so, yes. Ah. And, uh, and this um, this what? is a new one I mean it's it's not pleasant planted this year but it's the first time it's it's flowered mm. this pink one here mm. and it's a sort of dusky pink isn't it a greyish pink mm. moody pink yes so. yes uh, uh, is it, was it, who was it last night Miss Havisham oh yes a real Miss Havisham pink that is isn't it mm. Mm. and um and there's this lovely yellow one with the white in the centre of the petals, on the outside petals. Yes, that's like, um, it's more a, like spring, a spring festival, May Day festival, isn't it? Yeah, it's like some very exotic ice cream. Oh yes, or a marriage. Yes. If somebody liked yellow particularly. And this one's a new one. You might need to go around so you get the sun. Oh yeah. Yes, yes, a carnival of colour. Mm, they're coming out too fast. Are they? Yes. Why is that? So much draw them. They last. They last th three days really. First day coming out. Yes. Second day, sort of, they'll hold it. And the third day, they hold it, and then. If you're lucky, the fourth day it might still be a petal or two in position, but it'll look a bit weak. Hmm. But the colours change, don't they? You can see how the colours have gone much more faded here. Oh yeah. I think that's on its third day. Huh. And there's a, um, a cosmos here crept in somehow to the iris bed. That's right. And I planted those, what are they called, the things with these? Allium. Allium. They're little alliums, aren't they? Mm, they look quite nice in them, then. And there's a the little allium. Oh, you've planted those in then, have you? Mm -hmm. Oh, there's the little allium. My allium hasn't really done very well this year. I, I, I can see some chicks running around. They, they're a bit photogenic, these chicks. They want to be in the picture, don't they? Mm. Yes, they look nice with the bows. Got the orange one over there, in that bed. Oh, better go over to the orange one in the other bed. Do the proper whole, whole affair then orange one and I think I have drawn it and I've got the picture that's not quite finished so I might be able to work on it. I think it gets yellower as it over the days and the, the buds are still quite green aren't they? They're a greeny brown. That uh, is a really sort of powerful orange in there isn't oh it? Oh yes that, that the beardy bit. The beardy bit. <coughs> Is an orange, that beardy bit. Yes. With fluorescent colours in your felt Hmm. And uh, behind it is the um, what you call the common old garden iris. Or is that, it the wild one? <coughs> that uh, that I got from Free Cycle. From Shaftesbury, somebody gave them to us. That's nice of them. And they've done well. Right. Bye for now. <laughs>